So you're wondering how much does it start? How much does the startup cost of buying stocks? Well, to be honest with you, if you use the right broker, you don't have to have a minimum. Um, you can start with twenty, thirty dollars. It doesn't matter. Like Share Builder, uh, I think I started out with fifty bucks. Worked my way up. Um, automatic Investments. Um, I do the Advantage Plan. That's only twelve bucks. Each trade, you get twelve free trades with that. That's automatic. Come on. So you can dollar cost average. If you don't know what dollar cost average is, look it up. Um, it's it's not expensive. You don't have to worry about how much does it cost to start buying stocks. They want you to believe that it costs a lot, but it doesn't. It's cheap. Um, look into automatic investments because unless you have a lot of money. Um, and you want to spend eight ninety five, six ninety five, seven ninety five per trade, which you probably don't want to do. Um, and uh, one of the best things about automatic investments is you set up a dollar cost averaging plan, and next thing you know, all of a sudden you have income. Your dollar cost averaging will keep you in the money, keep you on top, and uh, you'll come on ahead. So the question is, how much does it cost? I say you could start for a couple bucks. Below hundred below hundred dollars to start if you're doing it right. Yeah, some brokers, some places they want twenty five hundred, two thousand just to start. Well, there are other options like Share Builder, um, Share Builder, Trade King. I don't think you have a minimum on those. So I know for sure about Share Builder. I don't know about Trade King. I've never used that before. All right, guys. Thanks.